Some say Alabama is facing a child care crisis. As many as 40% of parents who need child care don't have access to it. Now, three groups that advocate for children are addressing the issue head on. After two years of study, today they released their findings. WSFA 12 News reporter Julia Avant has our story. A new survey shows on average parents miss around two weeks of work a year because they lack access to child care. Now three statewide groups are coming together to offer solutions. The spotlight came on child care in the pandemic because in order to work, child care is the workforce behind the workforce. In order for people to work, if you have families, you have to have somewhere for your children to be. The Alabama Partnership for Children, Alabama School Readiness Alliance, and Voices for Alabama Children have presented a so-called roadmap. Areas of interest include improving child care business models, increasing the available workforce, making child care more affordable and more accessible in certain areas. While child care providers can work to make their own improvements, the partnership says state lawmakers also must intervene to offer better guidance and government funding. I hope that they see that there's an importance for child care, that working parents need this, that centers like myself and um, Ms. Sharon's who home center need those extra funds to continue to have our doors open and us continuing to be able to offer child care is a super important part um, of our everyday community and so they'll see it and say okay we need to back these people, they may, they may need some funds. In today's news conference, the partnership also reiterated the importance of child care, sharing data that shows children who are enrolled in child care have higher test scores, better behavioral scores, and fewer absences in K through 12. Mark. All right, Julia, thank you. Families and providers will continue to advocate, they say, for change in April at the Strolling Thunder event at the state capitol.